yeah it is the not cell 2022 and uh, of course activities have been ongoing for the past three days now today comes the top day and uh, it's um, the church service aspect of it this morning and uh, top military officers are gathered uh, ranging from generals top uh, 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 military officers ranging from generals, major captains, brigadier generals all over are gathered here this morning to observe the service, the Christian service aspect of the day. And um, very soon, any moment from now, the, acti the church activities will begin and uh, they will all be going in to offer prayers to God. Um, in commemoration of the 2022 NATSEL um, uh, uh, activities, talking about the Nigerian Army Day celebration. Right here at the, um, uh, 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 the, the Baptist Church and the barracks, and that is where it's been, uh, is going to be holding. Every person are represented all over the nations. Top generals from all over the nations are represented here to observe the day. We'll be bringing you updates as things unfold right here from Oweri, the Imo State capital. Yes, again, okay, a uh, little correction to be made. It's not Baptist Church, but then St. Mark's Military Church, Obinze Barracks, 34 Atlari Brigade. That is where the service is going to be taking place this morning. And here are uh, the clergy, the choir that will be entering any moment now and uh, we will be observing the service we promise to continue to update you as things unfold top dignitaries are still coming in top military officers are still coming in one after the other and i tell you it's going to be a memorable event yeah the message this morning is going to be given by colonel very reverend father May Magani is a colonel and he will be the one to give the charge this morning. That's him over there. And I tell you, today indeed is going to be a memorable day for the military across the nation. Yes, the military officers are not here alone. They are being supported by their wives. As you can see, they are all here to take part in the church activities this morning. They are all going to be praying to God to continue to strengthen the nation's military, to continue to strengthen the army, even as they fight against insurgency and to maintain the unity of the country.